just looks like, ah! A lot of things people think about horror writers. Uh, I think it was Christopher Lee who said, we're all supposed to look like Dracula or Frankenstein, but in fact, we all look like insurance salesmen ne from next door. We're all actually really normal. miles an hour just going at a really good clip nobody on the highway in a second I look behind me and there's this big huge truck right up my rear so I pulled over and let him by and as the truck went by I looked up and I could swear that the guy was wearing sunglasses it was like three o'clock in the morning he's wearing sunglasses and the there was a red glow all over the cab and I thought oh man that's scary so I had to use that The Ford cut almost diagonally across the truck's path. Sparks flew as metal scraped against metal. The truck popped up off the highway and into the air, driving over the Ford's hood and crumpling the tiny car beneath it like paper. The rear wheels of the tractor bounced off the Ford's ruined hood, and the entire semi-trailer lurched to the right, its fifth wheel twisting like a broken spine as it plowed into a clearing off the edge of the highway. I've tapped into a lot of my fears. A lot of the times, my stories, I write about someone else, some, something happening to someone else. I have this great fear of something terrible happening to someone I love and not being able to do anything about it, having to stand there helpless while someone suffers or is in pain. Another one of my fears is not growing old but growing old and dying before I've had a chance to accomplish anything. Life cut short, like in your teens or even as a child, that terrifies me, it scares the hell out of me because I think everybody should have a chance. Horror elicits an emotional response from the reader, whether it raises the hair on the back of your neck or turns your stomach. It's not so much a genre that you go into the store and look on the shelf, oh, here is the horror section. It's an emotion that you can find across the genres. You can find horror in mystery, in romance, in science fiction, and in the mainstream. So it's more of, of an emotion than a genre. It also satisfies my, my need to have a really good ending. You know, something where you get to the end, boom, and you know the story's over and someone had a little <gasps> gasp.